All smiles here with Giggly Chickadee. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, or good night, whatever time it may be. Welcome to my channel. So today I wanted to talk about Play-Doh's Closet. I've been thrifting, but not really in the store because it's, you know, everything that's going on. So Play-Doh's Closet introduced their online shopping, and I thought it was really cool because not only you can shop from the the Play-Dohs that's in your area, you can shop from multiple areas. So you can go on their site and see whatever you want and they will ship it to you. Uh, I don't know if they ship out of states, but they definitely ship anywhere in state. And I mean by like, if I lived in like Las Vegas and I lived in Tennessee, then they would ship from Las Vegas to Tennessee. That's what I'm saying. So on that note, you can go to their site I had shopped from the Play-Doh's Cool Springs. And you can just go there and look at what's on the site that you like. Say, for instance, you want this and you add it to your cart. All you have to do is sign up and most of the sites have free shipping over $50 and most of them have 75 shipping. And you, they have free curbside pickup, so you can buy from the site at your own store. Like, say you live in Las Vegas, you can um, shop from the site, and then you can go pick it up from the curb. So that's what you do from that one. I don't want to buy this, so I'm just going to remove it. Um, I'm going to show you guys a couple of things that I bought. I have bought a lot of items, but... The only thing that you have to look out for is that I was looking for shorts because I wanted like a vintage kind of shorts and I'm shopping. I bought the items and the day that they shipped them, they sent me an email stating that the shorts that I bought, they couldn't find them. So when you are buying things, make sure, well not make sure because you can't, you can't make sure if they have them or not, but you can call and ask. You can call and ask them and see if they have those shorts before you buy them, or you can purchase them just to find out that they don't have them. That's the only thing that I'm having a uh, concern with certain Play-Dohs. Um, I shopped from another Play-Dohs and that did not happen to me. This is the only Play-Dohs that had happened to me. They, um, when I got the package, the manager had wrote me a letter. She had wrote me a letter and the letter says, Dear Thea Sanders, my name is Sandra and I am the store manager at the Play-Dohs Cool Springs. I wanted to write you personally regarding your order. I apologize for three out of the five items were not found. We recently reopened the store the past week and we are still adjusting to the new normal of the store. And for our customers, we want to thank you for your purchase and supporting a small business. The team myself hope you enjoy your new items. Yes, I enjoy my new items, but the items that I got I definitely wouldn't have bought because the stuff that I really wanted was the stuff that they didn't have, which is not fair. They didn't, they didn't offer me really anything. I got my money back, but it's still not fair because those shorts, if you did not have them, then why are they on your site? You know, I know that everything has happened and everything, but still the store closed and all your stuff should be up to date, which is not fair. But anyway, I just want to let you guys know that if you go on Plato's Closet, um, any online that you need to be alert that you may or may not get the shorts. But I want to show you guys what I received that I did receive with my package.
guys. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. Stay tuned for next week's video. I'm not sure what I'm going to do. But stay tuned for next week's video. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.